What is up? It is Friday, December 23rd. I know, I'm picking up the camera, shocker. Um, I'm off today, which is nice. And Declan gets to, got to go to daycare because he's at a new daycare because of my new job. So he is able to be there even when I'm not working, which is nice. So I have been trying to take advantage of that. Um, I dropped him off and then I went to Starbucks, which I'm still drinking this. Stocks are going crazy. Um, I got Starbucks, something to drink, um, and then I also got a breakfast sandwich, which I've already eaten. And then, because I was, I'm like, okay, I'm already out, and I have some errands I need to run. Let me just go do them right now. So, I stopped at Planet Fitness, um, and I canceled my membership because I did get a new gym membership. I can't remember if I talked about that or not, um, but I did get a membership somewhere else that is more geared towards not beginners. Um, not that there's anything wrong with that, but it has more weightlifting equipment and stuff, which I like. And then it was in the same plaza as Target, which is why I did it when I did, um, because I needed to go get stuff for the stockings um, for Matt and Declan. And we needed to get more pull-ups because we're on the last pack. So I figured while I was there, I was going to get stuff. So I was like, you know what? Let me just, while I'm out, run my errands, grab my last minute Christmas stuff. Um, and then, hey, you two stop. Um, and then I'm just taking a sit down for just a second um, in my comfy sweater, leggings, and my slippers with socks. Um comfy but cute look I guess um, I am wearing my little wreath earrings and my little mitten earrings um, I have a friend of a friend who's kind of become my friend who makes clay earrings um, and I love her stuff and so when she came out with her Christmas collection I bought a lot um, and these are one of my favorites um, so I wear them a lot so you know something as simple as throwing on earrings just helps me feel better now it's kind of like if you're an OG and you remember when I used to wear lipstick all the time, it's kind of like that. My earrings are now my new I feel naked if I don't have it item. Um, so I'm going to sit for just a second and then I'm going to finish cleaning. I did a little bit of a pickup last night to try to make it easier on myself. Like I unloaded and loaded the dishwasher, folded the laundry from last weekend because I've gotten bad about that. Um, we're going to blame it on the pregnancy, though. That's what we're going to blame it on. Um, and then I switched over the laundry, so I switched it over again this morning. Um, so now I can just empty the dishwasher, wipe off the counters, and um, fold the laundry that's in the dryer, switch over the stuff into the dryer that's in the washer. Um, and then... I need to vacuum, clean the bathroom, um, wipe off the kitchen table because that's where I'm going to try and wrap more presents. Um, I did do the bulk of Declan's already, most of them. Um, I did those like a week or two ago. I was trying to be smart because I knew I was going to be uncomfortably pregnant at this point. Um, and I did them on the floor, but I'm home alone, so I really don't feel like maybe getting stuck on the floor. So I'm gonna just wipe off the kitchen table, clear it off, wrap Matt's presents, and um, the few stocking things that I got for Declan that are gonna go in there. And I figured I'd take you guys along with me um, for a little vlog I have not filmed at all in December. So I figured, you know, I should probably do something. Um, I don't have any clue when this is gonna go up. Um, it's kind of all just going to depend. So I am on baby watch basically. Um, he could come at any day. I'm 37 weeks in a day. So he's considered fully baked. Um, the latest I'm going to go is 39 weeks, um, with an induction. So at most 13 days left. So that's crazy. Um, yeah, so I'm going to get some stuff done, but I'm just taking a chill out for a second. I did have to plug in my camera battery this morning. I was planning on while I was getting ready, ready, I didn't do much. I was going to do an intro and a little a bit of a life update. 
but my camera battery was dead. So I had to find my charger for the battery, which works because while I was looking for that, I found my son's social security card, which I could not find. So that's good. I was about to just order a new one. I knew his number, but I didn't have the card in case I needed it. So that's good that I found that. So I'm about to do some cleaning and then wrap some presents. And then this afternoon we have another activity, but I'll tell you what that is when it gets. It is now Tuesday the 27th and I'm doing something I was not planning on doing. Um, the disaster of chaos of stuff everywhere. It's driving this pregnant lady crazy. So I actually, when I did my Walmart pickup order, because we also didn't have groceries, I bought a tote. That is now full of Christmas stuff. The only thing we have to do is take down the tree and the lights outside, and then it's done. Um, I'm just getting tired of not having counter space, so this counter has no Christmas stuff on it, so I can get it all cleared off. That is de -Christmified. The kitchen is done. All the knickknacks are done. Other Everything but the Christmas blankets, the Christmas pillows for our bed, and the tree, which I just took the ornaments off and the lights outside, and that's it. Because this is going to be crazy. So I knew if I did not, I was going to be a few days postpartum, at stuck home alone, bored, and feeling crazy because there's stuff everywhere. And I was going to push myself too hard. So I just ended up, I was like, let me just take some of these knickknacks put them in the tote before I knew it, I had done all of it. So it's about 7.30 now. Um, Matt is going into the shed to grab one of the totes that was supposed to be for Christmas stuff so that I can get the overflowing tote of fall stuff put away so that I can get lids on those so that they're more contained. And then I'll try and fold that laundry tonight. So that'll be good. We'll have to figure out a new storage for all of Declan's toys, but yeah. That's what we're doing. I didn't really, I didn't film anything Christmas. Um, did not film. Didn't film much that day either, but that's the update. I'm just gonna work on tidying up a little bit more. I'm just kind of waiting for the baby to come at this point because I'm tired and done. So 37 weeks, five days today. So we'll see when this child decides to come. What is up? It is Friday the 30th. Um, it's a few minutes before four and I am actually home as you can imagine at 38 weeks pregnant I am sleeping like absolute shit um I have not been sleeping very well and I just I couldn't do it I was sitting there just playing on my phone doing nothing and I had already warned you this morning that I might leave early because I just don't feel good so I said it was because of weather. I was afraid of driving in the weather because it did snow again last night, but I really don't care about the weather. But I just, I couldn't do it. So I'm filling up my water because I'm trying to drink more water. So I'm filling up my water and then I'm going to try and just relax. I would love to try and take a nap. However, I don't think the dogs are going to let me do that, but I may try and take a nap before the independent but yet clingy toddler comes home from daycare. Um, we did, we've been keeping up on the dishes and stuff. I did fold the laundry last night from last weekend and I can't do that this weekend because I have to wash our laundry and fold it because if this child does not come by Thursday um, I will be going to the hospital at 5 a.m. for an induction. So this is my last weekend to like kind of get stuff done that I would like to get done before I'm recovering. Because the first week week or two, I'm not going to be kind of taking it easy. Um, especially that first like week, I really won't be doing much. So I would like to not have a pile of laundry that would keep piling up. So I would like to have that done. Um, so I'm probably about to start our load because I always typically start it Friday night. So I'm going to start Friday's laundry and I don't think there's anything in the dryer, but if there is, I'll fold what's in the dryer 
and then I'm going to try and just relax. I'd like to take a nap, but it may just be resting, but that's fine too. Um, we don't really have many plans for the New Year's Eve weekend. Um, kind of. So, New Year's Eve we're going to Matt's sister's house. They live like a block from us. Um, because we didn't do anything for Christmas because his other sister was going to be out of town. Um, with their baby and her husband. So, we were like, well, we'll just do something New Year's Eve. So, we're going to go over there New Year's Eve and do like our Christmas thing. And just spend time together. And then I would like to go thrifting this weekend. Um, partially because I need to find something for these toys. Because um, it's not very clear. But uh, all the toys on the floor are going to drive me crazy. And the basket that his toys are currently in was already overflowing before Christmas. So I need to find something. But I also don't want just like an ugly plastic toy bin. I want it to still be aesthetic. Um, not really. I just, I want something that'll look okay. So I want to go thrifting and see if maybe I can find something. Like even if it's just like one of those cubby dressers where we just add some baskets or something for him to put the toys in or something. Um, if not, I will be going and grabbing something somewhere this weekend because I'm trying to not make it so that I'm going to have to push myself too hard after like right after having the baby. Um, and I know having toys everywhere is going to drive me crazy. So I would like to have a handle on that um, or at least have something ordered. And yeah, that's about it for right now. But those are the only plans. Matt wants to go to Cabela's. So it's like kind of uh, just doing what we want weekend, but also the only real plan we have is his sisters. Whew. Other than that, we don't have anything we have to do. Everything else is just a, if we want to. Um, obviously groceries will be in a must, but we're pretty well stocked still because I didn't get our groceries this week until Tuesday. So we did use the Instapot yesterday for Instapot pork chops and it was actually pretty good. They were nice and tender, which was good. So I just figured I'd update you. He is... Welcome to come anytime now. I would love it to not be pregnant by New Year's, but I'm not going to hold my breath since it's literally Friday and um, the 30th. So I'm not holding my breath because that would mean he comes today or tomorrow. But either way, the 5th is only less than a week away. Max, five, five full days pregnant left. And the sixth day, I'd be going to the hospital. I almost at the airport. So, yeah, that's the update. What's up? It is 9.24 on the 31st. I slept like crap again last night. I had several spurts um, where I was up for several hours. So I think I maybe got like two hours of sleep. But we're still going to try and get stuff done. I'm about to switch over the dishes. Um, I did fold... I did like, change over the laundry and everything. So I'm gonna fold that today, wash the sheets that are on the bed and put on a different pair of sheets. Um, just cause those are flannel and I know that postpartum I will be waking up sweating if I'm in flannel sheets. So I'm gonna do that. So I'm going to switch over the dishwasher and then we have to go shopping today um we still have to get some a present for matt's sister's stepson um and we have to wrap his and we have to wrap kemma's which is his sister's baby his other sister um so we still have to wrap their presents and i need the mission today which i think i already showed you is to find new toy storage so that's the mission for today of what we're going to try and get done. And then just, you know, that requires thrift shopping, which I did not do yesterday. Because I would like to try and thrift something if I can instead of buying new. But I know it's going to drive me crazy. So if I can't find something at the thrift store, then we will just go buy something. Okay. 
Is that your favorite toy? That's one of his favorite toys he got. Um, he got that from Nana Papa for Christmas. And he loves it. So now he's trying to chase the dog with it. Um, but yeah, switch over the stuff and get rolling. I'll let you know if I end up finding something. I will find something this weekend. It's just whether it's going to be new or thrifted. It is later now. I did some housework. Now I am trying to drink some water. And I'm going to curl my hair. Maybe do a little bit of light makeup just because I'm feeling kind of like beach whale today. Um, yeah. I'm 38 weeks and two days. I have a max of five days left being pregnant. So I'm feeling large and in charge and just kind of puffy today. So I'm going to drink some water. Make myself look a little presentable. And then when I we put Declan down for a nap, Matt's going to stay here with Declan. And I'm going to go thrifting and just do a little shopping to see what I can find for organization stuff. And probably like more comfy clothes and maybe just clothes in general. Because um, that's one of the things I really want to do this year is like figure out my style more my personal style as well as my house style so that's the plan that's what we're doing right now nothing crazy it's kind of just a chill chill weekend but also trying to get stuff done at the same time for somebody who doesn't get ready doesn't do hair doesn't do makeup i think i did pretty good um yeah i feel more human I still feel like a whale, but I feel like I at least look put together now. Um, first time, my best friend got these for me actually. Um, that I have not, that I'm not wearing my clay earrings. Because I normally wear like my earrings, my clay earrings like this. Um, but I was feeling something different today. So we just went with the, the gold, um, gold my hair which I'm still loving the red, by the way, and then did makeup. I even did, like, a foundation, so that's impressive for me. So I'm just going to eat probably leftover pizza from last night and then throw on shoes because right now I'm just wearing my slippers. And, yeah, that's the final look so far, which I feel like the hair could have been better, but it didn't. I was having a hard time wanting to curl, and my hair doesn't stay curled anyway. But I figured for a little bit before I put it back in my tried and true claw clip. Um, yeah, I feel like I need to do a lip because my lip looks kind of bare, but we'll see after I eat how I feel. In an interesting turn of events, I have had to change glasses. Very thankful that I had a extra pair of glasses because for some reason I just went to wipe off my lenses and the frame literally broke. Granted, they were $15 glasses, so I'm honestly surprised they lasted that long. Um, but, so now I'm wearing my brown pair, which are a little bit more, they were like $50, but I'm very glad, because they're the correct prescription. Because I really don't feel like going to get new glasses, especially because I'm supposed to make an eye appointment after I have the baby, because I am overdue for an eye exam, but I didn't want to get one because your eyes change when you're pregnant so I wanted to wait until after so I'm about to go to the thrift store because you might as well it's better than just sitting around waiting to go into labor maybe if I walk around it'll do something maybe it won't I don't know but yeah it's gonna throw me off that I have these ones on but I'm gonna go to my favorite thrift store and we'll see if I show you anything I've, I'm in the mood to film today, I guess, but I'll just embrace it. So I'm going to go to the thrift store. It's like 107 right now. So I'm going to jam out, drive over there, have my water that I'm still drinking, and we'll see what we can find. I haven't been thrifting in a long time. That's why I'm feeling the itch. While Matt gets Declan up, I figured I'd do a quick haul of the stuff I got. Um... So I got this at Big Lots. It says, please remain seated for the entire performance. And I thought this would be hilarious to put on the wall that I have in the bathroom with all the funny 
things like this. I thought that would be funny. I'm just doing the haul that I got. You haven't seen this stuff either. From this uh, salt and pepper shaker set thing. Because obviously we're going to need that. I got a lot of mugs for the coffee stand. Um, since all the Christmas ones are done. So this one was like $2.99. Um, that was from the thrift store. These I got at um, Big Lots. It's just a farmhouse home candle. That one smelled really good. And then a JT Aloe candle. That one also smelled really good. Because obviously all the Christmas scents are gone. Um, I got another little cup. It just says Starbucks on it. A little espresso cup for the coffee bar. I got this like tan one that's got speckles on it. Um, for the bar. And I think that one, the only other cup I got was this one. So it's green and white. It says Hello Beautiful on the top. And it's actually for tea, but I thought this would be cute on um, coffee bar. Um, I also got, within like five seconds of walking in, these little, I don't even know what they technically are, but I thought these would be cute little knickknacks for the bookshelves or something, um, because why not? The real steal of the deal is I got this Pioneer Woman mixing bowl set for very cheap. So it's got the orange and the red and the blue. Oh, I didn't even realize they're dishwasher safe, so that's nice too. Obviously going to wash these before we use them. Just put them right in the sink. And then I got comfy clothes that I found. So I got this matching PJ set. Just buttoned down. I figured that would be comfortable. Please, like, black comfy pants. Or black. Purple comfy pants. Because, why not? I've got this blue suede pair. And they're, like, just stripes. I don't, I don't know the, the term for that. And then just another pair of sweatpants. And then I also got these big pillows for the couch and dog treats and two big totes so that I could put the rest of that stuff away. So that's what we got. That's what I got from the three stores I went to. It was and yeah. So I got some some stuff. That little shelf thing is going to be temporary because it is pretty wobbly. It's just until I can find something that matches the aesthetic, I guess. But now we're going to go to his sister's house and do a little New Year's Eve thing. What is up? It is now January 2nd. Monday. I'm not working today. And at max, I only have two full work days left before I have this baby. Which is crazy. And then I have six weeks off. But I'm going to go to the gym. Try and work this baby out. I know that's like kind of old wives tales but I'm hoping walking might help so I'm just gonna do something simple like walking and whatever I feel up to doing it's gonna be really short but I just feel like movement is not bad anyway and it'll help plus I wanted to try out my new gym bag um, yeah I'm gonna go ahead to the gym and probably just walk on the treadmill um, or something I did do skincare today as well. My skin feels really soft. Um, Cause I had won the Frey package from um, Kelly Yeager. Um, she did Vlogmas and I won one of her, her giveaways. And the stuff is really smooth on my skin. But I'm gonna go work out. And then when we put Declan down for quiet time, I wanna edit this video, so. I will update you after the gym and then that'll probably be the end.